hobbsing.com. Thanks for joining me for another video beer review. This time we've got a bottle of beer from one of my favourite breweries at the moment, and it's Omnipolo from Sweden. This is a bottle of their, you can see it on the back bit better, Onda, which is a 5% ABV pale ale hopped with just mosaic from what I can make out anyway. Yeah, I think Omnipolo makes some seriously like, just creative, inventive, but most of all, really flavoursome beers. I mean, they're, they're often pretty murky, like chicken stock a lot of the time, but just got so much kind of hot flavour in there that I don't mind, to be honest. And I think this is one, just like it really, I mean, very, very, I mean, that's pretty, that's near on opaque. I mean, you can barely see anything through that, or you can't see me through that on there. I mean, very kind of pale orange, it's like chalky orange, but yeah, I don't mind. And clarity is great if you're going for clar clarity in a beer. I know this has got a silly amount of hops in it, so you can have a bit of kind of protein haze. But that's got a lot of it. <laughs> Pure white froth on top, so I've got a swirl and a sniff. I've got a rough idea, it's going to smell like mosaic. And it does. Ow. <laughs> that is raging. If you like mosaic, and that's, I think this is mosaic at its best, really. It's big, pungent. Pineapple, slightly musty and resinous and quite skunky and yeah, big pungent aroma. Hint of kind of nail varnish, pine trees, um, dandelions. Yeah, great. Pi pineapple. Maybe hint of grapefruit, but it's just massive. I mean, <laughs> it smells incredible. Sometimes. Um, single hop beers can be a bit one dimensional, but sometimes a hop can carry it. Smells great. Let's see what it tastes like. Let's dive in. Cheers. Yeah, and it's very enjoyable. It's not kind of over the top. But... Pine, bitter orange, bitter grapefruit, kind of like pithy. It's the pith and the rind of those citrus fruits, quite, quite sharp. Something, it's that pungent thing, it once again reminds me of like wildflowers. The back end, slightly chalky, bit of, and a lingering, I'd say grapefruit bitterness. Mm. If you, you're a big fan of mosaic, if you want to know what mosaic smells and tastes like, this is a perfect example. As you can see, uber pale, so I'm sure the, the malts that they're using in there are, are bringing in very little character, because there's so little malt character in there at all. It's all about the hops. It's all about showcasing that one particular hop, a quite a popular one at the moment. One where I'm, once again, I'm not a big Simcoe fan, and Mosaic is a very close relation to Simcoe. But I think that's absolutely stonking. And once again, as I said, I'm not a big Simcoe fan, but I like Simcoe when it's used well on its own. And this is really nicely used mosaic on its own. So absolutely lovely stuff. Another winner from Omnipolo in Sweden. That is a bottle of their Onda Mosaic Pale Ale. 5% ABV. Very nice indeed. I'm Rob from popscene.com. I'll see you next time. Cheers.